Hello crafty friends, it's Alicia of the Call Me Crafty Al YouTube channel and it is time for one of my favorite videos of the month, the Sheet Load Showcase. I hope you'll stick around and see what all of my collaborators created this month. Thank you so much for stopping by today. If this is your first time to my channel, I hope that by the end of this video, you'll be inspired to click on that subscribe button below and ring that bell for notifications. If you're already a subscriber and regular viewer, welcome back. I'm so glad that you're here again. Each month, I like to stop by and share a look with you at what my collaborators have created for the month. This way, if you haven't gotten the chance to hop around and see their creations, you can see them here in one spot and then use those links in that description box below to go find out more about what they created. This month for September 2022, you will see that they yielded at least 12 cards using just six pieces of six by six pattern paper and some cardstock. Here in front of me is the set I made, and there are a few special things about this month. The overall size is a mini slimline, but it is also a tent topper card. So you have it so it can stand up like that. And then there's that fun element hanging off the top. And it does also use six by six paper, like I mentioned. Now, if you haven't yet seen my debut and process video where I tell you how you can download the printable for free and then show you how I made this set, I will have both of those videos linked in the description box below. As always, a sheet load of cards is free to all of my subscribers. Now, if you're going to share your sheet load or show us your sheet load, there are a few ways you can do that here on YouTube, over on Instagram or TikTok with the hashtags at the top of each printable. And you can also send in a card for the end of the month feature. I will have the show us your sheet load guidelines video linked, guess where, in that description box as well. Let's go ahead and see what the team created this month. Before we get to those cards, I do have a special channel member shout out. I would like to say thank you and welcome to Paper Trimmer Level Membership to Lisa Parker. I'm so glad that you decided to become a member, Lisa. A big thank you as well to all of my channel members. Your support each month keeps me creating here on YouTube and sheet load of cards free for all. If you would like to find out more about the perks of channel membership, I do have a link in that description box below. And now, let's see those cards. Up first on the YouTube channel is Danny of Danny's Dreams. You might recognize this mermazing set of cards from this month's thumbnail. I just love all of those different images and how she's colored them all in. Creative Chelsea made a set of thank you cards this month. I love kind of those muted pastels with the big bold pop of red. And what a fun shape to hang off the top with that die cut out. Ashley of Mint Twist Cards made a sheet load of summer cards this month. I love those fun papers and the fun shapes that she chose for her sentiments. Karen of Karen's Crafting Company paired some wood grain and floral pattern papers with that big bold sentiment this month. They are definitely awesome. Teresa of Fresh and Renewed with Teresa made a set of adorable Halloween cards. I just love all of those cute focal points and pattern paper she chose. Beth from Bourbon Creek Crafts made a set of Happy Fall cards this month. I just love everything about these from the pattern papers to that fun sentiment. Amalia from Cool Cakes and Crafts with Amalia created this fun bright set of cards this month. I love the little inspiring sentiment and that fun flower on the topper. 
Karen Aiken created this set of adorable birthday cards. I just love all of those fun focal points, especially the ones with the kitties on them. Toby of the Bitty Penny channel has created a set of wonderful cards. I am loving the sentiment on there, the dream big paired with those layered stars. Now, speaking of Toby, if you didn't catch us live last weekend, she did get together with my sister and I for a fun and inspiring evening of crafting. I will have the Oh So Inspired Live video or replay linked in that description box below if you would like to check it out. Yvette of Yvette Olea Creates made a set of fall thank you cards. I just love all of these adorable focal points and the wide variety on the cards. And speaking of fall cards, Stacy, who is at Craftaholic Mama on Instagram, also used that theme for her set this month. These papers and ephemera on the focal point are part of Not Too Shabby's latest box of the month. Barbara, who is at One Busy Bee on Instagram, created this set of lovely cards. I like the variety of sentiments and the flowers and foliage on those focal points. At AZ Crafty, aka No Way Me, has created a set of Halloween cards this month. And even though they say they're spooky, I think they're awfully cute. At Stamp with Sandy put a fun twist on this month's sheet load by literally twisting it or rotating it. I like that she chose to give this a try, and those fun gold leaves are such a great accent. Jessica, who is at Jessie Kate Creates, made a set of Christmas cards this month, and I love how she has used some gift tags from her stash for the fun toppers on her cards. Lisa, who is at Scrapbook Girl on Instagram, created a wide variety of cards this month by using different collections and different focal points. They're all so cute and fun. At Fuzzy Slippers Designs, aka Mariah, created a set of fall cards this month, and I love how the pumpkins fit perfectly on those ovals and the fun addition of the orange thread. Weren't all of those amazing? I swear, they make me look so good. Thank you to everyone who is on my team for your continued dedication, creativity, time, etc. I'm so glad to have you. Now, if you loved seeing this showcase, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and then don't forget to visit those links in that description box below and leave the creators some love. You can also use the hashtag in the title to see the creator cards here on YouTube. And I do have a search for the tag over on Instagram. I know that they would love for you to stop by. Until my next video, I hope you're all having a crafty day. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch all the way to the end of the video. Now I hope that you'll consider clicking on one of the playlists or videos I have linked above.